everyone welcome back to my channel we're still getting things prepared and ready for baby to come i will be having the baby in three weeks and six days very excited total 27 days away cannot wait to meet her so we got a lot to get done before she gets here so this is my diapering caddy um i have one of these with all, all three of my other kids it is just a very good idea to just kind of have everything in one place I have a list that I'm working with here that I made. I have actually marked off a couple of things because there's no need for a onesie, to, in my opinion, for a onesie and a small blanket to be in this, in this caddy. But everything else I find necessary. Okay, so right here on top, the reason this is on top and not tucked in somewhere is because this is, see, time to feed baby. So this is not just diapering. This is breastfeeding, bottle feeding. It's a log. But down here you see this line that says diaper. So when I change the diaper, I'll be able to log it. So it needs to be in here as well. So the idea behind this basket, yes, it'll travel around that house with me, but I kind of want to keep the idea of in the middle of the night. I mean, yes, I will use it during the day. It will be very sufficient during the day, but in the middle of the night, it will be really, really handy. Okay, so I have my journal or my log here and a pen. Okay. So here we have some diapers. These are just two of the sample Pampers diapers that came in some of the, the freebie videos like the Target a bag and the Bye Bye Baby bag and stuff like that. So that's just what those are. This is all Honest Company here. Back here is the changing pad that I actually got with my free breast pump. Yeah, sorry, my free breast pump. So that's what that is. Here I just have some regular old Walmart wipes. Have some hand mittens in case she um, flings hers off in the middle of the night. I have the trash bags here. I do have refills of this, obviously, but they're not, it's not going to live in this basket. They will just, I'll refill it as needed. I have a burnt cloth, which is also going to be used kind of like as a washcloth if we have major messes. I have a, it's a gown. This is, I love these gowns. If this is your first baby, uh, get gowns. Uh, they are stretchy at the bottom. You just pull them up, change the diaper, pull them back down. So she will sleep in gowns quite a bit. And then I have a pacifier in case, you know, she wants one. Or in case we lose, you know, it's just good to have a pacifier. And then speaking of that, we have some pacifier wipes in here. There's one wipe in each. These are samples that I got. So if I use these up, I will not replace them with these, but I'll just add some other pacifier wipes in here have some lotion. Uh, I use lotion quite a bit, some Aveeno baby lotion. So if she's dry or whatever, like her skin's really dry in the middle of the night or if my hands are really bad, I'll just, I'll do some lotion super quick. Have some Honest Company hand sanitizer spray because I'm not gonna get up and wash my hands in the middle of the night, I know me, but I will spray my hands down when I get done with every single diaper. And then I just have some, you know, Parents' Choice diaper rash ointment here. Okay. Things I am going to add to this that I don't have in here. Um, a small flashlight, that way I don't have to turn on our big lamp whenever I'm changing her. You know, I don't want to wake her up any more than I have to. I don't want to disturb my husband any more than I have to there. And the only other thing, but I find it very necessary, alcohol wipes. You know, the little square alcohol wipes because um, I, just every time I change the diaper, I do the umbilical cord. Just every time, no problem, just... You know, we got to keep that thing clean. So, that is my diaper caddy. Oh, and this I just got at the Dollar Tree, this little basket here. So, I didn't want something, you know, huge because I don't think it's necessary. So, that is my diaper changing caddy. Thank y'all for watching.